Hi YouTubers, Signal Hunter here. I want to show you these antennas. Uh, these antennas, this one, is uh, identical to the one on the first video that I made about the antenna. I already got installed outside. And uh, this ant just the antenna runs about uh, 19 euros, which is what? Oh, I don't know, $21 or something like that. And here's the Balon. Or Balon however you're UN, UN, whatever you want to call it, uh, you can use this for not only receiving but transmitting. And uh, the reason why I buy these because they're fairly cheap. I think this one was uh, like 25 euros. And then this one, it has to do with the wattage, was like uh, uh, 23, 24 euros. And uh, this, is a, this wire is 10 meters long. And this one is 12.5, like the one I already have installed. And this is the one I'm going to take up to a, a um, higher than the other one and uh, attach it to the uh, uh, antenna mast I have out there, which is actually not an antenna mast, but it is a uh, camouflage uh, support. So, anyway, the only thing about these antennas is uh, the rope that comes on them, they're kind of cheesy. So uh, I don't really use those. I just cut them off and use them to tie something else up with because I want to use some something a little higher quality. And as I said, this is this described. You can see the color here. It's brass color, brass rope. And this antenna wire is uh, fairly stiff. So uh, it likes to uncoil like a spring when you uh, release the wire ties on it, which I like because it's... It won't kink on you. And uh, that's why I open them outside. <laughs> okay, well, that's the Valons. And uh, I'm going to show you the inside of them. So, there's the inside of these uh, Valons. And uh, as I examine them pretty close, I really can't tell the difference why one would be 200 watts uh, and the other 100 watts. Like I say, you can transmit or receive maybe the ferrite ring is a little heavier or the composition is different or uh, just looking at it I can't tell if uh, it has more wraps on it or what it really doesn't matter to me because I'm not going to transmit on on these uh, uh, some people told me well those don't make a difference when you're receiving shortwave signals but uh, I beg to differ because I've tried this antenna this like this also without a uh, Balon and uh, it doesn't work as well it the noise floor is a lot higher so anyway that's that and the only thing I really don't like about these is this cover doesn't have a, a what we call a gummy seal or a gasket on it that's the only thing I don't like but uh, when I take the other one down I'm going to look at it to see if it's building any moisture in it because I may need to drill a weep hole in it because we have a lot of bad weather here with a lot of snow and ice and uh, so I guess there's a possibility it could build up condensation on the inside I don't know but I'll see you later when we take it apart and examine it okay so have a good day and I'll show you another video later on uh, when I get them up or maybe in the process of putting them up I don't know uh, so I hope everybody has a good day and uh, what I want to say about about these also anybody can do this and uh, fairly cheaply and uh, I actually bought these Balons on sale they normally run about 45 euros some of them as high as 60 on eBay you know how that is and uh, but I, the reason why I bought them it doesn't matter about the wattage like I said but it's the price and uh, you know you want to get the best bang for your euro or your dollar and uh, so but still I buy what's on sale because <laughs> I'm a poor guy okay have a good day everyone 73 to you